Okay, today I wanted to talk about prime factors or prime factorization. First of all, what is a prime number? A prime number is a number like 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, and so on. A prime number is a number that only one and itself can divide evenly into. Okay, okay these are all prime. If they're not prime, they're composite. And let me show you composite numbers. Composite would be 4, 6, 8, 12, and so on. So composite numbers could be can be divided by other numbers other than itself and 1. Prime numbers can only be divided by itself and 1. Let's look at three numbers, 10, 20, and 36. And I want to write the prime factors of each of these numbers. For example, 10, the prime factors are 2 times 5. Both 2 and 5 are prime, and they're both prime factors of 10. Let's look at 20. 2 times 2 times 5 are all prime, and they're prime factors of 20. 2 times 2 is 4 times 5 is 20. Let's look at 36. 2 times 2 times 3 times 3. If I multiply this out, these are all prime factors of 36. Now with 20 and 36, if I was asked to find the prime factors of all of these numbers, but 20 and 36, I can write those differently. I could write this like this, or I can say 2 squared times 5. Or with 36, I can say 2 squared times 3 squared. Okay? So now what I want to do is show two ways to find uh, your prime factors of a number. The first way is a factor tree. A factor tree. And it's called a factor tree because it looks like a tree. Let's look at 150, 150, 182, and 392. Okay, for 150, if I can start with a factor, a prime factor, I, I'll start with a prime factor, but in this case I can see that 10 times 15 equals 150. Now I still, these are not prime yet, so 2 times 5 equals 10, and 3 times 5 equals 15. Now I have all prime numbers, 2, 5, 3, and 5. And at the bottom I can write 2 times 3 times 5 times 5. These, these are my prime factors of 150. I can also write it 2 times 3 times 5 squared. Alright, let's do 182. I'm going to start with the prime number 2 times 91. Okay, now I'm going to work with this number 91. 7 times 13. Now all my numbers are prime. 2 times 7 times 13. Okay, three prime numbers. Those that 2 times 7 times 13 are prime factors of 182. Let's look at 392. Again, I'm going to start off with a prime number. 2 times 196. Okay, 196. 2 times 98. Okay, 98. 2 times 49. And then 49 is 7 times 7. So my prime factors are 2, 2, 2, 7, and 7. And I'm going to write those over here. 2 times 2 times 2 times 7 times 7 are my prime factors of 392. Or I can write it 2 to the third times 7 squared. All right. Now there's another way that you can uh, factor numbers. I'm going to show you that. Let's look at this. It's called the ladder. 
and just like a ladder we're only going to do two numbers but let's look at 150 again put a little L around it and let's look at 182 put an L around that alright if you can start off with the prime number 2 will go into 150 75 times okay 75 3 will go, in, go into 75 25 times 5 will go into 25 5 times now I have my prime factors on the outside of the ladder 2 3 5 and 5 so these are my prime factors 2 times 3 times 5 times 5 or I can write it 2 times 3 times 5 squared alright let's look at 182 2 will go, in, go into 182 91 times now 91 I know 7 will go into 91 13 times these are all my prime factors of 182 so I can write them 2 times 7 times 13 these are my prime factors of 182 these are my prime factors of, of 150 so I can use either the latter or I can go back and I can use the factor tree either way you can find your prime factors of a number alright that's it